Hello and welcome back to NSUSpartans.com. Fueled by Gatorade, Ross Gordon joined by tonight's Spartan Partners postgame player of the game, Preston Bunge, in his second game back for the Spartans. Ended up with 19 points, 8 rebounds, 5 blocks, and 4 steals tonight to lead the way for Norfolk State. But the Spartans fall 83-80. to First of all, Preston, just getting back in game shape a little bit. Uh, I know it doesn't look like you lost any shape, but uh, you, you're getting back in game shape. First of all, it's your second game back. Talk a little bit about how you feel. Um, it just feels good to be back out there. You know, after having a season ending injury like that, it just feels great to be back on the court with my teammates um, and just be, be in the atmosphere again. Uh, we didn't win tonight. It's a ball game, but a, a lot of it is, is us. You, it's, that's a good thing. It's what we can do to get better. Um, biggest thing for us was turnovers tonight, 26, and they scored 27 points off of those turnovers. Talk a little bit about some of those things that you can do and your team can do to, just to make sure you control the basketball. Yeah, like you said, we, we beat ourselves. I think that's happened the past three games. Um, so we've touched the stove three times now, so we just got to learn. Um, but the 26 turnovers, that's unacceptable. I mean, they weren't trapping, they weren't pressing, they weren't doing anything. So that's just us not being mentally locked in. So I think we just got to work in practice and correct all those things that we keep doing that to beat ourselves. Uh, we get on the road again, a, a longer road trip. We go out to California. And, and I know games like this sometimes get to stick in your head. How do you get this thing not to be something that haunts us and, and we get past it? I mean, it would have been great to win this one, have some momentum going into San Diego. But like you said, um, we got three or four days to practice before we go out there. So we just got to use those days and really lock in, focus in, and, and get us right before we go out there. So I think that's, that's how we forget about this. Uh, game where we go closer to your coast. You're, you're from uh, you're from over that way, and maybe not all the way California. So you get a chance to get home. It's a closer drive than maybe Virginia is for some of your family. What is it going to be like to play on the West Coast uh, in your last year? Uh, I'm really excited. Uh, my mom's going to be in San Diego. A lot of my friends and family are going to be in Phoenix. So it'll be nice to get back to the West Coast for a few days, and then uh, before coming back east. So. Exactly right. Uh, a lot to learn from from this ball game. I know you guys will do it again. What's one of, what's one of those things that you know that you have to do coming into these next couple of days? I think we need to really work on our rebounding and keeping people in front. They were killing us for dribble penetration, kicking out to their shooters. They did a great job of that. So we got to really just work on our defense um, as a whole and rebounding. Uh, the Spartans go out west to take on San Diego and then go to Grand Canyon University as the Spartans hit their road for their next two ball games. The final score here tonight, 83-80. Thank you, Preston, for joining us. I'm Ross Gordon. Thank you for watching NSUSpartans.com, fueled by Gatorade.